So why do we start uh, our lives on earth? Um, why don't we just develop? Because uh, earth, uh, see, what God has done is that if, if we all began our life in our spirit body, there would be so much sensory input that it would be almost like a sensory overload. So the beauty of a physical body is that it has limited sensory input. So that then allows us to slowly develop and absorb. It's a bit like asking me the question, why don't we all go to university when we're born? And it's the same answer. It's because if you place a baby in university, what's its capacity? <laughs> little, right? That little capacity. So little capacity to learn and absorb in that it has to go through a process of growth. And so what God has designed is a process of growth while the soul is primarily associated with the physical body, and then a process of growth while the soul is associated with the spirit body, and then a process of growth that where the soul is just itself. Does that make sense to everyone? Like a, it's a beautiful process that I, that I feel happens. So part of this university is to learn fear? Uh, no, there's no need to learn fear, but you see we have free will. So we have the free will to learn fear. And unfortunately, people in our past, way beyond when we were born, chose to learn about fear more than they chose to learn about love. And for that reason, we are bearing the consequences of that choice. And it's just the same as you. If you choose to learn more about fear than love, then your child will bear the consequences of that choice. Now, my feelings are, if we can't change for the sake of our children, then who can we change for? So if we can't learn to do more loving things for the sake of our own child, then it's highly unlikely we're going to do it for ourselves or anybody else. So God has also created this system to look at our child, children and go, wow, I've created fear in that child. Wow, I need to look at myself you know, and change here so that this stops. And, and if we are not able to do that with our own child, it's highly unlikely we will have any stronger motivation in our entire life to do it with anyone else.